Hi, this is the Air Boy. This is Shivam Patel. This is Janet Gomez. And we are, we are Team, team five. 5. So we are here to present the project highlights. Purchasing a house is the biggest investment in a lifetime decision. We did gain more knowledge about real estate, got hands-on experience dealing with huge data set. The goals of the project were to predict, analyze, and identify. The following are the research questions we considered during the project. Initial exploration showed that our house cost an average 180000 The following features show a comparison between above average and below average house. This chart shows that most houses that are above average price do have AC and the ones that are below average, 10% of them do not. The following two charts show the garage type attributes depending on the house price. Thank you Deera for the commencement of the project highlight. Our data source is Craggle.com and the link is here. Data collection. We got separate training and test set, and so we merged them into a single data set. As you can notice, that our data set has 81 features. Exploring missing values. We have total 13,965 missing values in our data set. Table shows the missing value by features, and the heat map shows the ratio of missing values in the data set. The data cleaning process starts from here including missing values for the features where NAs are replaced by zero. Features where NA are replaced by more. These features are mostly categorical features. Features where NA are replaced by no. These features are mostly factorial. This is a special case of rectifying the errors, after which our dataset has zero missing values. Feature conversion. Converting integer to factor, character to numeric, and character to factor by using s.factor and s.numeric function. We are creating binary features by converting factorial features to zeros and one, which is numeric. Here are the examples of some more features converted to binary. Feature engineering. Creating a new feature by adding two or more related features or by multiplying two or more related features. We are splitting our dataset into test and train dataset for data preparation. Here are some correlation plots for our training dataset. Identifying weak relation. We use Baruta algorithm for our feature selection. The features in green are selected by Baruta algorithms. Removing outlier by box plot function. The histogram of the target feature shows skewness. Now I pass on to Yanet for further analysis. Thank you, Shivam. As you saw in the previous graph, the target variable was right skewed, so we are going to apply a log transformation on it to normalize it, and now we are ready to model. Our first model, linear regression. We got an R score of 0.88 and we got a score on Kaggle of 0.14, which placed us like halfway through all of the submissions. Good start. Our second model, Lasso Regression, got us an R score of 0.86 and placed us at 0.13, so a marked improvement from our previous linear model. Next, we tried a regression tree, and this was actually the worst performing model so far. Our next model, uh, Extreme Gradient Boosting, is the one that I'm most excited about. It got us a 0.14 on Kaggle, so I want to do some tuning on it and see if we can do better. And this is how our models are doing on Kaggle. As you can see, the lasso model 
is currently doing the best out of all of them, while Decision Tree is doing the worst. I want to focus on the next step on the XGBoost model and see if we can improve it and move up. After some extensive uh, tuning on the XGBoost regression model, we moved up 295 places on Kaggle, placing us at number 1620 out of 4559 entries. Best performing model yet. Take it away, Chivam. For more details, key takeaway, our code, and live presentation, join us on Zoom Saturday, 25th April, 10:40 a.m. Here is the link. I thank my team, Vera Boy, Yannet Gomes, and this is me, Shivam Patel, signing off. Thank you.